Sometimes people ask me where I find the energy to put out so many videos and I tell them it's, it's coffee. I've been asked on more than one occasion, Aaron, how did you get this godlike physique? I, I tell them it's, it's coffee. I get asked just about everywhere I go, Aaron, how are you so verbally fluid? How are you so charismatic? And I, 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 I tell them it, it's coffee. This episode of the Evolution Daily Fitness, Physique, Update, and Weigh-In is brought to you by the Evolution Daily Coffee Company. <sighs> Yet to be established. Yo, what's up guys? It's me, Aaron, with Evolution Daily Fitness. And uh, ever since I started lifting a lot, I just feel like a complete and total badass. I can tell my testosterone is through the fucking roof. And uh... We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get this, uh, we're gonna do this fucking weigh-in, alright? Alright, let's fucking weigh in. Here we go. Two nineteen point four. Last week's with camera number was two twenty-one point six. So it's only like a two pound difference. Alright, let's do the let's do the off camera. Let's do the uh, or camera camera off rather, I guess I'd say. Let's see here what do we got. What do we got here? Alright. 216.4. So I'm gonna have to compare that to last week's numbers, but I think it was I think it was 221. I think it was I think it was oh uh, uh, sorry about that, sorry about that. I think it was uh I think it was 221, 221 last week with camera. And then uh, now I think it's um, uh, 219.4. Whatever, it's progress, right? I mean, it's it, it's something. It's nothing. Here's the thing, okay? You're not going to lose that much weight when you're lifting. Because I really, I lifted hard this week. Hopefully, you'll be able to tell on my fucking physique update. I lifted hard this week. Um, the thing that's actually kind of fucking up my weight number, though, for sure, is that this past... So, as you guys know, and I've talked about this in the last videos... Um, I'm, I'm, I'm doing carbohydrates, so so I'm doing uh, anywhere from 150 uh, to 200 maximum carbohydrates per day. That's the absolute max. I mean, I, I've, I've, I don't go over 200, but then there's days where I do go out to like a big dinner or something like that, and I do my best earlier in those days to not go, to not even hit like 30 carbs beforehand. So that's what happened on Saturday, but on Saturday, which is just two days ago, which that's why it's fucking up my weight. If uh, I, I overloaded, I went out to this like big fucking Chinese dinner, basically like fucking fusion steakhouse, whatever. And, um, I overloaded and I think that's messed up my weight. So I would actually even venture to say that here in like two or three days, even that number is actually going to go down by like two, three pounds. Cause it's like, I'm just kind of holding on to that that fucking fat, that disgustingness from eating just tons of, of Chinese food. So we'll see, but um, here's the, uh, here's the, uh, wait, wait, hold on a second. Hang on, I'm feeling like a badass again, hang on. All right, now it's, uh, now it's time for the physique update. Here we go. All right, here we go. Ugh. Gonna compare it to last week's uh, here in this, this video, I'll uh, probably put the uh, the week one and the week two next to it. You know, slow. You know, nothing phenomenal yet, but I can tell. I can tell even from looking at the little screen on the camera right now. I'm looking a little bit better than I was last week, for sure. Working on this belly hang, almost really almost nothing there. Thank God, because that's the worst, man. Nobody nobody wants that. I mean, I think I think just kind of overall, overall, I'm just fucking. <sighs> 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 Alright, now you might not think that the transformation is phenomenal, but that's where you're wrong. Everything I do is phenomenal. Alright, so definitely not the greatest week for weight loss, I guess, but again, like, the thing is, if I wanted to lose weight really, really quickly, I would really just stay off of the carbs, and I've done that in the past. You know, I've talked about how, you know, I've lost over 100 pounds before by doing essentially no carbohydrates. It's called the slow carb diet from Tim Ferriss. So I did no carbs, but I allowed myself some beans, um, about an avocado a day, uh, roughly, you know, if I could keep up with that. 
and then I allowed myself vegetables because technically I guess people that are hardcore into Atkins they don't do even vegetables because it takes you out of ketosis or some shit whatever but when I was doing that diet here's the difference okay so my gains are slow I guess like my, my weight loss gains my 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 losses I suppose you'd say uh, are slowed but I feel really good and I'm strong so when I was doing the no carb before I felt weak all the time you know I would do no carb and I would I would go into the gym and I just I wasn't making any progress in the gym and not only that but it felt like fucking painful whereas now you know I might have like a 50 grams of carbs meal um, or like like 40 typically you know maybe I'll have like a sandwich two pieces of bread which is 32 grams of carbs then I'll have a Greek yogurt with 20 grams of protein um, you know making it 40 grams of carbs and, uh, and 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 then what I'll do is is then go into the gym and when I'm there you know, I, f I feel good. I feel good throughout my day. I have more energy throughout the day. So I'm not, I, what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to create more of like a sustainable kind of lifestyle as opposed to like this crazy diet that's like so hard for me to fucking upkeep that like every, every fucking day, day four and five of no carb, I'm like, God, I need my cheat day. I need my cheat day. I need my cheat day. I'm like practically fucking meditating to not eat like chocolate covered almonds and shit like that, you know? I actually haven't had any simple sugar in the last two weeks, but because I'm still having bread sometimes, I'm having these rice cakes sometimes, I'm having like these frozen meals that kind of have some pasta and stuff like that, I don't even like crave the simple sugar as much. So definitely soon within the next couple of weeks, I'm gonna start kind of covering more of what I'm doing for my workouts because I am on a very specific workout routine. Uh, but for now, I just wanted to do this physique update as well as this uh, weigh in and see if I've really made any progress. Stay accountable to you guys. I appreciate you watching the videos. Make sure you subscribe. It's a loud ass car. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you yet to do so already. And um, I'm gonna I'm gonna start pumping out a little more videos on this channel. You guys are gonna see uh, just kind of what it is that I'm eating. Maybe showing some pretty basic recipes, stuff like that. Just just fucking whatever, you know. Just again documenting my fitness evolution. Peace.